Hey folks, welcome back to a Legacy of the Weezard. Hooray! Last time, uh, we went with Pochi here. Today, oh, okay. Pochi, Mena, Zem, Roas, Lil. Today we're going Zem. Look at that man. His little round hands. <clears throat> so Zem can use the armor and the gloves, which Pochi cannot use. He can also use these shoes, which I think um, deal damage when you land on an enemy. We're going to take both of those. Now Zem has got about the same jump. He's got a much stronger attack, but roughly the same range. And unlike Pochi, Zem can take damage from enemies, so we gotta be careful. <clears throat> Zem can't make that jump anyway. Zem's path, not my favorite. Zem's path is a little... Yeah, looking at the video now. Zem is just invisible. Um, I think that's magic, now that I think about it. Ooh, money. Still need keys. Um, Zem's path is annoying because we have to do... some block puzzles with Zem. And if you remember, your uh, your video game, aw, your video game history, um, the NES controller only has two action buttons, A and B, and pushing blocks requires you to basically push like two and a half buttons at the same time. It's complicated. Well, it doesn't matter how far you fall, the damage is always one. Zim's invisible again. Those uh, tiles with the lady face on them uh, can be used later to teleport. The scroll seems to appear on that screen quite a bit. Dance, Zem, dance. Okay, go away. Remember that block. That's a hurting block. That's bread. That's healing bread. <clears throat> oh, you know what? I need an item for Zem first. Hmm. Yep, I uh, forgot. I gotta get back out of here. That's uh, easier said than done. Because I don't have the crystal equipped. <clears throat> I forgot to get this on the way. Can I get out this way? I can get out this way. I 
It's actually in this section what I need. This guy is a jerk and a half. Bread. Don't see bread very much as Pochi because you don't take a lot of damage. Take a look here. As of did, um... Went <coughs> back to the same room. That's right. She's a pochy of her chest plank. Grab it anyway. High low path. Take the high path. So the scroll to the right. Keep that right. See it then. And do ba do do do. Okay. We gotta go back up. I miss this. How, viewers, did I miss this? It just walked on my head. It's alright. I threw an axe at him and turned him into bread. <clears throat> now that I've basically got half life again, the game's gonna start giving me potions or poison. I love the face they make when they die. I, I like the speed, but I don't like that it makes me weak. We need to go this way. We did not go this way before. Having that scroll means we take damage when we jump. That chest. I'll take bread. I don't remember what's in that one. Money! Money's alright. Oh, that just lets us avoid the monsters. Okay. <clears throat> that works for me. I was so excited about getting started. Specter guy. You just got stranded down here. He's trapped. I'll bet you one of those chests is fake. I wonder if there are hidden blocks up there. Hmm. In this weird fish thing. That is one of three items that Zem gets that only Zem can use. We gotta go to it in anyway. <sighs> uh. 
That's mean game. Uh, by the way, sorry about the audio mix last time. It sounded fine in my headphones. Um, but I didn't have my headphones turned up all the way. So when I was editing the video... Oh! That, uh, that mix is not very good, I said to myself. Now that we have the glove, go ahead and unequip that stuff. Take the glove. If I remember right, everything on the top row is infinite use. Everything on the bottom row, with a couple of exceptions, are one-time use. Of course, just got my health back. Why not? For some reason, I thought that the poison wouldn't hurt me if I grabbed the ring first. I was wrong. Get away from me, Frankenstein. Ah. That guy looks like a monster from Arkista's ring to me. <laughs> I don't know what's in it, but I want to find out. Super bread! You can't walk off the ladder, you have to jump and then move. It's tricky to get a hang of. Okay. Now that we have the glove, we can get it into Zemzeri. We can't even get in there without the glove. I don't want what you're giving me, game. <laughs> I would trade one fewer scroll and one fewer ring for a key each time. Because I don't know where the refresh rate is going to put it, but I know that you can't see Zem sometimes when I pick the ring up. So this block here, there's a key. This is what I can now push with the glove. And it's a bit of a pain, as we as we said. Go away, zombie man, mama man. Here they come. They're coming. Hold the A button to activate the block moving. Ooh, the spiky shoes. I'm gonna buy them. I don't know why I keep grabbing it. That is... Crossbow? Yeah, top top row kind of in the center next to the spiky shoes. Um, are those spiky shoes? Those are uh, power boots, I think they're called. Well, the other thing we need, though, is the mattock. We need to make sure we grab that. Oh, and the dragon's name is Keela. I had the dragon's name wrong. I apologize. I don't remember what I called him in the first video, but I don't think it was Keela. Welcome to Zem's area. What a fine time it is. Glove practice. Jump, push. Use 
Use a key. Get 20 keys. And there you go. That's that's really the... Uh, this is just a room to let you reset the screen because we have block puzzles. That's not the way I wanted that to go. You can do all sorts of weird stuff with blocks. Generally, you cannot get yourself in a spot where you, um, can't get out. that I recommend trying it. There we go. Oops. I need... That one back. No! That's wrong. There we go. No! Can't pull it. Blocks have to be pushed. And if you... I got hurt there because when I jumped, what was happening is the block was trying to occupy the space I was occupying because I was... the way I was holding the D-pad. There we go. There's about six screens of this. back that way. Now, thankfully, the game generally is kind enough to let the reset spots um let's see, can't, can't do anything with that one. That one's stuck. The game is generally kind enough to give you a spot where you can reset without having to start the whole room again. Probably the best way to do it is just equip and unequip the block at, or the glove as needed. I was hoping that would reset, but it did not. So we will go down the ladder and reset the puzzle. That's not what I wanted. Thank you. 
Diagonals don't really work. What? I was pushing left. Do something. That something is save state. Ah. What I want to do. That'll work. Do I need anything in that shop? No. But I need to get down there, because the way out... I don't know if you saw that guy just fall through the floor. Set for this room. I think we gotta fall onto that chest. Right. Let's see. The puzzle one did to do. Scrolling, scrolling. There was a whole section in this walkthrough that was just the glove puzzles. So. I don't really know what I'm looking at is part of the problem. Let's find that section again. These also don't really look like uh, where I've been. <clears throat> that doesn't look like Puzzle 1 very much. Well, yeah, I guess. It's just squished. Puzzle 2. I don't know. That's still Puzzle 1. There's Puzzle 2. Okay. I don't know what's in that chest. I just want to know what's in that chest. I guess I'll never know. Unless I go get it. We need to get a block over there. This section being horrible. That's partly why. Fake chest. Well, it didn't kill me outright, though. Like it was said it would in that other spot we were reading. I 
He's stopping. Right before that corner. Which tells me, you can fall through the floor. Some enemies will use ladders, some don't. Let's save right there. Don't care. I like the design of this room. Because it's a mouth. Okay. Out of there. We're okay. I kind of hate this. Okay, back here. Filthy with keys. So these guys stop right there. So that's a fake block. We know that one's fake. Okay. Gloves on ladders. That's fun. Oh no, that won't work. What do we do? That's what you do. You leave. being a thing. It's not. Uh-oh. We did the thing we're not supposed to be able to do, and we are trapped. We are going to starve. We will be here forever until we die. So, the mouth is below us. That's an eye right there. That's another one. Equip glove. Glove will work better if it is equipped. Ooh. This is me getting smushed. Now. I want it to go right, but it can't go right. Oh, yeah, I can. Just had to fall on it. I was trying to jump and push instead of just fall. Okay, 
go in there. <clears throat> if I get the block underneath it, I can go in. That's hard to do. Super bread! I will take super bread. Reset. Reset. Now that looks like something I should be able to handle, right? Now what I gotta do... Move that. But what I need is I need another block over here to stand on. That one won't move any which way. That over there, that doesn't really do me any good. So. Here, shove that one out of the way. Push, push, push. Unequip the gloves so we don't screw anything up. Get an email. Very important to get an email when doing this puzzle. Okay, next we gotta get that block out of the way. Not what I wanted. I should have saved. Oh, yeah. At least the music's good. right there. So really, I just need to get one of those blocks roughly here. Now Zem can't make any jump, apparently. So what we're gonna do, give that a shove. Give that a shove. Shove, shove, shove. Shove. Okay, I'm good with that. Sorry, cat. Shove, shove. Shove, 
Shove. Shove. Gosh hecking, darn it. That'll work. Maybe. Zem. 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 Zem! Oh my gosh. What do I want? Grab, grab the ladder, Zem. <sighs> what I want to do is move that block down a little bit. If I just tap right, I fall. Same thing there. You can't scoot to the side of the ladder. Oh, that was close to what I wanted. That was not. Problem is, I have to be on top of it to push it down. If I'm on top of it, I don't really need to. Let's get some of that health back. Oops. That's not what I wanted. Should have unequipped the glove. Careful. Nope. There we go. Okay. Yeah, something we did earlier that we kind of pulled off there was Zem can ride on the block? Somehow? there. Because the block moved down twice that one time, we're, we're kind of in trouble. So we gotta get creative here. Nope. That got screwed up. That's my problem with the block puzzles in this game. Just because of the mechanics of it, it's really easy for them to get themselves screwed up. Like, why that one block moved down twice, I don't know. But because it did, it kind of screwed up. The other thing I was working on. See, and that's that's wrong. And I can only estimate sometimes what's going to happen. If the block can move in two different directions, odds are it will move in the direction I don't need it to move in. Save right there. Okay, on top of the block. Jump down. I wasn't even pushing the button that time. I just jumped. Okay, push that over. I think you can probably see what the idea is. There we go. Save there. Put that. I think that's our reset up top, and I think that ladder is a reset for us. Let's see what's down here. Yep, that's our reset. Okay. 
that's a really crummy place for a false floor. Thanks, Super Metroid. Way and see what we got. I just vaguely remember this. Fairly certain I do not. If I can move that one down, that'd be great. But I can't do that. I really do not want to scroll right now. That would not help me. So I can't push that up any higher. I mean, not from there, anyway. Nope. Go back. Go up. Man, I love fake floors. Ever told you how much I love fake floors? I think that's where I need to be. Up there. So let's see. We can tweak this a bit. So close. It's no good, viewers. And I have nowhere to reset now, because the end doesn't reset. Dang it. Come here, cat. Let me stand on you. back here and let me jump on you again. You're so close. Jump on the block and then jump up here. There you go. You're letting me down.
This isn't even the last one by the look of it. Let's take... Let's take some goodies. But not equip that one. Because I'm pretty sure... This means if I jump on an enemy, I kill it. Yeah. And then I get poisoned for my trouble. Climb the ladder. I can't. And even if I got the cat back over here... <sighs> well... that I kind of hate the glove. Um, it's not what I wanted. No! never moves the way I need or want it to move. If you will get up here, I can jump on you and get up there. And that will work for me. Pete's sake, come on, you're right there. There are other ways to do this, but it's just not worth the aggravation of the glove. I hate using the glove. Least favorite item in the game. And you have to use it. There's like eight of these puzzles. Pete's sake. Oh, come on. There. You can die. No. What? Okay, whatever. <laughs> I think that was bad. thing trying to kill me. Save. Oh. We need to get 
up there. There's our reset. There is a way. There. I don't know how I did that. And I don't know why it's not working that time. I don't know why I went down that time. It's all fake. All of that. You can't use these, as far as I know. I've never been able to successfully, you know, do anything with those. If I could knock one down and use it to, uh, you know, basically like make a platform, I could do that. Yeah, I don't know why it works sometimes. Not other times. Need to go one higher. But Zem can't jump any higher than that. So a third block would be great. I can't get a third block because one of them went dag or to the wrong direction. So back we go. And I want to say, it's not like we have to do anything like this to win the game. You know? Like how some games, like, oh, we'll give them a like, kind of tricky puzzle to have to deal with. And, um... Then he'll have to do it later, like in the boss stage. Kind of like, think Mega Man 2 and those platforms on tracks in Crash Man stage that show up again in Wily's Fortress. This never happens again after this. Okay, this one? Go that way. You go left, you go left. Holding left. Yep, didn't think that would work the way I want. I'm trying to. That kind of worked. Hold left. Nope. I don't trust. I don't trust you. I feel like you're gonna screw up everything.
if you just land, the block moves out from under you, so you kind of have to move with the block. But you have to wait for the block to start moving first. It's very strange. Now, if I can get that one out of my way... Take that red, thank you! Unequip that! Big wall up here? No. Big wall's down there, then. I think I need that to get to it. ladder wasn't there, it would be easier. I don't think I can move that block. Thanks, Gabe. I think that's our crown. Can't kill that guy until you wake him up. He's like an Armas that way. I want it. I don't have enough money. I think that's like our magic key. And I think since that's our crown. So, yeah, um, let's unequip everything here. Equipping that takes our strength from 3 to 12. Equipping that doubles our distance. So that's what those do. Okay, let's save. them. Oh, that's the Matic. We need that anyway, so I will take it. It does take an extra magic to use some of these items. Not done yet, folks. More of this. So my mouse was on screen. I don't know if you saw it. Super bread! Use a key. Oh god, this. Guess what I have to do? <laughs> this is... 
it's not hard, but one screw up messes up the whole thing. So I can push these blocks like that. I'm gonna face left. Okay, face and left. Jump and hold the button. Not the D-pad, just the jump button. Now I'm gonna face right, same thing. Give that one a shove, hold left. Now that I have established left, jump, hold the jump button. Hold right, jump. Oh, that one won't go right. Why won't that one go right? Down the ladder we go. Do it again. I don't like that you can go through whatever those are. Push. Establish left. Jump hold A. Establish right. Jump hold A. Nope. Didn't want to do it again. Glove is weird. I've never liked it. Keep going. Sure. I know I don't need to be going through the reset thing as often as I am. Just do it because I'm scared. Ain't gonna lie, I'm a little scared. I don't want to screw it up. What's in the shop? Nothing I care about. What's in the inn? Sleep. Delicious, beautiful sleep. How long is this episode? Very long. Okay, let's drop a save. Down there. Chests over there that I... Do I care? Not about that one, oh god. Bleeding my skin. Get How do I get over there? Nope, you stay up there. Is it this way? We gotta be getting near the end of this.
Go away. Drop a save because we got block writing to do. It's like they were really proud of this. Can I? I can. I just need the blocks to get into those shops and head in. You go away. Take this or you die. What do you think's in there, viewers? Should we try and get it? That is, I think that's the elixir, and it refills your health. And the one without the wings is a magic potion and refills your magic. Here, I should care about. Doesn't look like it. There's another screen. What's in you, shop? I have both of those. I don't know how I'd manage that, but I'm proud of myself. That's less good. I need up there. I need back up there. Let me back up there. <laughs> Thanks, game. You know what? I'm gonna come over here. Come here, skeleton. You're even purple. Skeletor! I think that's where we need to be. I don't think it's the screen. game. I don't remember where I save stated last. Go! Zem! Whew. Back down here. Wait for, for somebody to show up that I can jump on. I would load to find out, but I'm afraid. I'm afraid of what I, what I would find out. Take your bread. Stay there, though. What you're supposed to do is ride that block. That one that Skeletor is hanging out by. 
Come on, Skeletor. Come on, Skeletor. Thanks for jumping off the screen, Skeletor. Yeah, you're kind of supposed to push one of those over and go from there. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this again. We will save there. Now, I think if you look real close, you can see which blocks are gonna break on you? You can probably see it. I don't think the compression's so bad that you can't. Zem! Zem! Get out of it, man! can't because it's one block wide and that means I'm just stuck here till I somehow manage to Jeez Louise Probably nothing I even want Bread, I'll take bread That is not the right way, so it's farther down this way. Is it right there? It's in that treasure chest. There's our crown. That means boss fight! I'm gonna go for power here. Because, yeah, power's good. Distance works better for Pochi's boss fight. I, you see what that guy did to my health? Get that fight over with quick. Okay. There we go, part two in the bag. I think we've got a, like an intermission part. We gotta get some stuff. And then next time we'll uh, move on and get our next crown. We've gotta get four crowns, you see. More later. <laughs>